Much of the war push is driven by the collapse of the financial system. It may not seem evident to everyone immediately. We're going to see what that is. If we can solve both at one time, which is the only way you can do it, you can't solve one problem and put the other one on the shelf and wait for it to be solved. You have to solve everything at the same time of, of, of substance. You know, you can, you can fix your car's flat tire, but you're not going to change the world system by just going one at a time. Now, the British US NATO war in Ukraine is driven by the British oligarchies and uh, American and NATO allies fear that the world financial system loaded with derivative debt, speculation, and Shaktian fascist policies against their own population is disintegrating at a faster rate than they can control. That dying looting system is the source of their wealth and gives them the power to dominate. They will do anything increasingly insane and irrational to preserve that system. Ukraine and confrontations over Taiwan are merely pretexts to realize century-old policies to dismember and break up Russia and China and to stop a Russia-China-India alliance along with developing nations to initiate an alternative nascent world credit system.